Welcome back to Anything German Shepherd. Today we're going to revisit the fascinating Lycan Shepherd by looking at some frequently asked questions. Let's get started. First of all, how much does a Lycan Shepherd cost? Okay, we're going to level with you here. Lycan Shepherd puppies are very expensive. You can expect to pay at least $3,000 for a Lycan Shepherd puppy, and at the higher end you can expect to pay as much as a whopping $5,000. That said, however, other rare breeds can cost just as much, at least at the $3,000 mark, so from that perspective, it's maybe not as expensive as it might be. The precise cost of a Lycan Shepherd depends on a number of different factors, such as the geography, the age of the dog, what generation of breeding it comes from, and so on. When shopping for a Lycan Shepherd, it's important to learn about the puppy's parentage in order to determine if it's a real Lycan Shepherd. Unfortunately, there are stories of people being sold fake Lycan Shepherds. Another common question is if Lycan Shepherds are good pets. As far as we're concerned, Lycan Shepherds make for excellent pets. They generally have a very nice temperament and they can take the training very easily. The Lycan Shepherd is meant to have the same brain to body ratio as a wolf, and it's commonly thought that this should give them a greater intelligence and better problem solving skills. And this really sells them as a pet because it means they can play all sorts of games. They're also playful and energetic, which means that they're well suited to more active families. They need to be kept well occupied as much as possible, and they need to have very frequent and energetic exercise. However, it's important to note that Lycan Shepherds are not a recommended breed for beginner dog owners, since they require quite a bit of training, escape proofing, and socialization. For these reasons, we would recommend this breed for younger and more active families, rather than for families and individuals who aren't particularly active and aren't as available to spend quality time with the dog. People also often wonder if Lycan Shepherds shed. Lycan Shepherds tend to have a very dark, thick double coat, and is usually black. All the breeds that the Lycan Shepherd is based on, namely the Blue Bay Shepherds, Working Line German Shepherds, and Belgian Malinois, are all breeds that shed quite a bit. So as you might expect, yes, Lycan Shepherds do shed their fur, and this can certainly occur seasonally, but can also happen year-round. Also, the coat of a Lycan Shepherd is not usually hypoallergenic, so it's not a recommended breed for those with dog fur allergies. If you're looking after a Lycan Shepherd, we strongly recommend that you brush their coat at least two or three times per week. You should also bathe the Lycan Shepherd with a mild dog-friendly shampoo every three to four months. One more popular question is, what is an F1 Lycan Shepherd? In dog breeding, the F and F1 stands for filial and is a simple way to denote the generation of a dog. F1 stands for first generation, F2 stands for second generation, F3 stands for third generation, and so on. The maternal and paternal parents of an F1 Lycan Shepherd can include any two of Blue Bay Shepherds, Working Lion German Shepherd, and Belgian Malinois. And the parents of an F2 Lycan Shepherd will include an F1 Lycan Shepherd and either another Lycan Shepherd or a Blue Bay Shepherd, Working Line German Shepherd, or Belgian Malinois. F1 breeds are less likely to have any of the typical health issues that you can get with later generation pure breeds. And finally, how big do Lycan Shepherds get? When a Lycan Shepherd is full grown, it can weigh anywhere between 55 and 80 pounds and can reach heights of 22 to 25 inches tall. So they're not too big and heavy, and you may still be able to pick them up from time to time if you need to. Thanks a lot for watching, we really hope you enjoyed this video. Please feel free to subscribe to our channel and don't forget to hit the like button. Until next time.